Hey y'all. Uh, I'm out here in the woods with F.S. Bushcraft and his son. And uh, the last couple days we've been out here and building a lean-to shelter, a double lean-to shelter. I'm going to give you a quick peek. You can see through there. There it is right there. And we have a 9 by 12 tarp over top of this back side. So you can see how tall that is. That's another 3 feet up. So that's a good uh, 12 foot by 11 foot one side of this. And the other side's about the same. And uh, we just threw that on there. And uh, on both sides. But it's uh, <laughs> quite a large size double lean to and it's going to work pretty nice when you get it all done got two uh, ridge poles up here and uh, as you see they're staggered as well one down below the other and then the walls just throws a drove into the ground and tie it off but we did it a little quicker this time Went to the dollar store and got a bunch of zip ties and tied these all in with zip ties. So, you know, this stuff here, this they're going to last a long time. And it's good for, uh, you know, strength as well. But I used uh, number 36 bank line and, you know, fastened these ridge poles and such. So, nice and strong, that's for sure. As you can see, this is basically right up to my neck height, the tarp right here, and that's the nine foot mark. So we have plenty of room in here to uh, put raised beds, or, you know, Peter from FS Bushcraft, he could put even his cot in here. But we was thinking, because this is 11 feet wide as well, if we wanted to, we could put a raised bed here, raised bed over here and a raised bed over here if we like it's uh it's pretty cool it's pretty cool okay so we got this all done and uh like i said we're going to put another tarp over top of the whole thing and it should drop down about a foot over top of the two tarps that we have so it's going to cover the whole thing we'll be able to put a fire pit in here if we want and such and do small fires and so on um, cover the sides in if we like as well, you know uh, It's a pretty nice little shelter it took us about six hours to complete kind of thing um, But Okay, I the only two tools I brought and uh, he brought a yard work saw and his uh, SCHF 37 and that's what I brought as well, but I brought a buck saw every one of uh, the limbs on all these were all trimmed off you know with the number 37 you know it, it, it works good it works really well and it's still sharp uh, but I've baton with it I've used it a lot this weekend I've been here since uh, Friday you know at noon and now it's Sunday afternoon and uh, used it a lot I stand by my word it is a good bushcraft knife and uh the whole three out of those series will make nice bushcraft knives and survival knives in my opinion so take care and i'll show you some pics of this shelter